starting with the lesson now. There's so much popular demand for the 300. If you consider reworked, smoked, Greek, old fashioned. So you can use anything that you would make a fashioned with just in the similar method. So should you prefer Zacapa rum? You can make it with Zacapa rum. The 300 is just title for, let's just say, the best of the, th of the old fashions, for example. It's the 300. It's usually either Metaxa 12 star or the Metaxa Reserve, which is the finest of Metaxa. Then our other ingredients, we use homemade bitters, um, basically Mediterranean bitters. Skinos Mastica is our liqueur. We just use a splash of that. This is from pine, like the pine trees we see in Santorini. The ones you see painted white. And the sap, a little splash in this adds a nice complexity to the drink. The other parts of the drink really is the, the, the garnish, the orange, and the cinnamon, which we would have used to smoke it, but today I'm gonna actually use uh, rosemary, just to make it a difference. Uh, so to start it off, we use a stirring jar. If you don't have a stirring jar, you could use a shaker or a mug. So I fill it up with ice. I add all my drinks. I give it my all, all. So I give it a little stir to get it all mixed together, and then we start the smoking. So let me get my ice. We always use ice from a deep freezer. It doesn't add as much dilution, and it gives you a lot more time to work with your drink. So I start with my bitters. I'm going to put three nice splashes in to neutralize and balance the sweetness of the drink. So one, two, three. My skinos. It's literally a splash. So now I'm going to do a generous measure because you're at home. Do it 100 ml so that you don't have to make it again and you make a large measure. There we are. Next, a little dash of honey. The using is very runny, so I'm not so fussed about. I only want a tiny little bit. I'm not expecting all of the honey to melt in this. I don't want it to because it is going to be too sweet. So I just dab the spoon in. Take a little tip off the edge because the flavour of the honey is nice. In the summer we use like orange blossom honey, thyme honey, so that adds a nice taste to the drink. Give it a nice stir so it's nicely mixed up. And now we're going to begin the smoking. The smoke just adds a nice flavour to it. And this is basically a smoker. Intake here and blows out here. Set it up like this. We use rosemary. Break up this rosemary so it's nice and easy to catch fire and i feed it into the nose like that and just leave it there then open the napkin up fold it into a triangle so you could use a face mask to cover it check this the coronavirus special just to modify we could go like that but a bit ridiculous hey <laughs> you lay it over and leave that there you get your lighter luckily i have a blowtorch and then let me turn this just so you can see. Turn your smoker on. I'm out of gas. A regular light will do just fine. So as you see, it starts sucking down. And can you see inside, it's filling up with smoke? Very pleasant. Can you see inside the smoke there? And then you want to start swirling it. So that now you're working that smoke into the drinks, getting mixed up, adding a bit of the flavor. You go to serve it, you have your strainer ready, and as you open it, the nice effect of the smoke coming out, you cover it up and pour. You get this lovely effect of the smoke coming out, which is also infused your drink. That is your 300. Then after to decorate, what I would usually do is a few of these, but as we have a rosemary today available, I'll make a nice little decoration. Just pop this through a little hole in the orange and have it sit on top of the drink, just like that. I could even give it a little burn glaze if I had gas. That's all it is, very simple. Cheers, everybody. <sighs> Delicious. Looking forward to seeing you all. I'm really enjoying doing these cocktail classes for you every day. We're gonna make our YouTube channel working so we can put all these videos that I make for you now, at least in some sort of collage and get you some of those recipes. We'll be doing a lesson on bitters one day soon. That's your 300. And whenever you feel we want a piece of PK at home, you head down to your bar, watch your video, you make your cocktail. Hmm?